As it's Valentine's Day, I thought I'd talk about heartbreak in ancient Greece. Did the ancient Greeks have a cure for heartbreak? Yeah, they did, sort of. Not one I'd advise you doing, though, because it involved jumping off a cliff. On the Greek island of Lefkada, there is what's known as the White Rock. And apparently it was here that Aphrodite was mourning because she was heartbroken over losing Adonis. And Apollo suggested to her that if she just jumped off the cliff into the water, she'd be cured. And apparently it worked. So people tried it. The idea then was that if you fell in love and you were heartbroken, you'd jump off this cliff into the waters below and you'd be cured of it, either because you didn't make it or somehow it managed to actually cure you of your heartbreak. And we've got a list of people who apparently undertook this. And it comes courtesy of Conan. He was a Greek writing in the time of Augustus and he was a grammarian. Conan the grammarian. Close. Here are a few of the names of the people that took the plunge, literally, and what happened to them. Hippomedon didn't survive. Nicostratus, who may have been the son of Aristophanes, not unsure about that, he survived. Macy's did this four times, and he survived all of them, so he was obviously falling in love a lot. And finally, Rodope, she fell in love with twins. We're not sure if this was to get over both of them, or just one of them, but sadly it didn't matter too much, because she didn't survive. Just in case you're interested, I did an article about this and I'll go into it a bit more in depth and to also talk about something else which may have been going on here. And that's all on my website, ancientblogger.com. Whatever you're doing or whatever you're not doing on Valentine's Day, enjoy yourself. And if you are feeling a bit heartbroken on a serious point, just look after yourself, OK? Take a moment, watch a film, chill out, speak to someone. Anyway, leave a comment, ask a question, that kind of stuff.